Chest pain that occurs in a patient who's having a heart attack, typically, is very severe. Severe squeezing, burning, or pressure, often radiating to the jaw, to the arm, down the, the arm. Uh, often associated with shortness of breath or nausea uh, or a feeling of impending doom. These are characteristic of a heart attack. So more severe and last longer and more associated symptoms. Chronic chest pain, which occurs in patients who have coronary artery disease but don't have a sudden blockage of an artery, those patients may develop symptoms with some physical exertion or with emotional stress. And the symptoms are more mild, more mild squeezing, burning, or pressure, and often not associated with nausea, sweating, uh, and feeling of doom. Uh, more likely, uh, if they are associated with any symptoms, maybe a little shortness of breath. When we talk about chronic chest pain, we're talking about chest pain that patients have experienced on and off for weeks, months, or even years. Acute chest pain, sort of the chest pain that might be associated with a heart attack, is something that comes on suddenly that often the patients have never experienced anything like that pain or the severity of that pain in the past.